All right, everybody. Uh, what's going on tonight? Uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about, well, actually, I thought I'd throw my hat in the uh, cage about video, uh, a video about Brad Casper. It seems like everybody who, who has any channel that's related to fitness, bodybuilding, etc., has uh, numerous videos about Brad Castleberry. Uh, a lot of people uh, getting tons of hits and uh, making a nice little chunk of change talking about this guy. I don't really follow him. Uh, on Instagram, I don't follow him on Facebook, uh, you know, YouTube, whatever it is. I, I really don't know a whole lot about him, but I have run into the fake weight videos that people are making. And it uh, seems to be the big hubbub. Uh, one of the big hubbubs right now, and uh, Brad Castleberry, uh, you know, the main thing, like I said, is the fake weights. He gets accused of using fake weights. He, he's been shown doing some pretty impressive lifts uh, with some monster uh, weights, doing rows with a shit ton of weights. The thing that I notice about a lot of lifts is the, the range of motion is, is not uh, really uh, too too dramatic, too large, pretty small, like five inches on some of this stuff, four inches, whatever it is. Uh, again, nevertheless, he is moving the weight, so he, obviously he's a pretty strong guy. He's built real well, uh, pretty thick. I think he's like five foot ten, two fifty, uh, something like that. So he's got a uh, you know built pretty good, got a great physique, uh, and no doubtly a strong guy. One of the issues with Brad though is that he claims to have done and broken a lot of world records on lifts uh, that, of course, cannot be substantiated, cannot be proven, etc. So that does not, uh, you know, does not bode well uh, for your humbleness, etc. And uh, you are going to get hammered uh, on YouTube. You are going to get hammered on social media. But in that regard, he still has a ton. Here's an old pick of Brad as a bodybuilder, uh, 2006. Uh, he still has a ton of followers. Uh, on all this stuff uh, so people I think you know it's kind of like a train wreck you can't really look away you, you want to know what's going on and one of the weirdest things about him that, that I find weird anyway is that he does a lot of stuff shirtless uh, you know in the gym uh, wherever it is outdoors I mean he, he runs around shirtless so I mean I know it's cool to be you know big and strong or whatever it is but uh, when you when you run around shirtless it's just weird man you look like a goof uh, doing that kind of shit but again he's been called out a complete you know ungodly amount of times by by some of the strongest guys in the world uh, they've called brad castleberry out asked him to prove his lifts i think there was a ten thousand dollar challenge uh, you know again here's another guy made another video about fake weights uh, again so uh you know it does, does not bode well uh, for people's uh, you know thoughts uh, on you and people's opinion of you when you when you brag about breaking world records uh when, when you're being accused of doing fake you know performing lists with fake weights now don't get me wrong even if he's got two plates uh on this that are fake you know that's still a lot of weight i'm not saying the guy's strong i mean that's a pretty impressive back uh, he's obviously a, a pretty strong dude regardless now there is uh actually mike o'hearn who, who himself um isn't really the most honest guy says he's clean but obviously he's not uh, went on record to say that he doesn't think brad castleberry uh, actually uses fake weights he says that uh, brad castleberry uh, is probably actually moving that kind of weight uh, and you know that's possible i mean we don't know for sure uh you know I, I, it's kind of hard to believe there wouldn't be pics of them maybe maybe moving this these fake weights in and out of wherever they're at i mean but maybe some of these gyms that have fake weights for photo shoots uh, you know, that happens a lot in bodybuilding, so people don't blow out their freaking knees and stuff. Uh, like, you know, the dude did a decade ago, John Pierre Fuchs or whatever his name was. Uh, but uh, that being said, um, he's being accused of the fake weight thing. He's being accused of photoshopping weights. Uh, and supposedly he claimed to have been uh, to the NFL Combine twice uh, when he only played four games in college, had four receptions for five yards. So the, those numbers don't get you to to an NFL combine. So I mean I don't know unless you can walk on an NFL. I don't know. Uh, you know here he is claiming to break another world record. I mean it, so it is what it is. Uh, you know Brad Castleberry. Uh, you know he's just gonna. But people follow this guy. Like I said, he's got you know ton people following him. So whatever he's doing, he's just drawing attention to himself, and, and it's working. People are still making videos as long as that happens. Uh, he's always gonna. Be in the in the spotlight, and that's exactly what he wants.